Michelle oh. and Naomi. I'm so sorry to disrupt your conversation. How are you two no, doing? No, not at all. All good. Um, this this show was a hard watch, but a must watch. Michelle, how do you prepare yourself for such an intense role? And then more importantly, how do you mind yourself when you're going through this? Yeah, interesting. Um, I I've never prepared more actually for a role. It was it was so it was pretty intense um having to get into the shoes of a barrister and i worked really closely with someone a barrister who coached me through pretty much all of those courtroom scenes um which was vital to kind of play it as authentically as i could um and I, with a with a role like this it was really important to have some levity in between um particularly in those courtroom scenes, which we, we, we talk a lot about in that, you know, they are very intense and we all have to sort of support each other. And, um, and then in between, it's important to have just some humor and some, some light moments, mm. because of course it is such an intense subject. Um, and, you know, I, there was a certain amount of kind of energy reserving I had to do for this role. I'm, I'm quite chatty on set. I like, you know, hanging out and just asking everyone what their evening was, you know, I, I'm yeah. sort of very chatty and, and I had to really um, stay in the zone a bit more for this um, because she is a sort of quite isolated character and I felt that was quite useful in a way. Mm -hmm until Naomi turned up and then I was like oh. <laughs> I know <laughs> well, <laughs> Naomi girls what can you do <laughs> but how, how do you do that because you do as Michelle's saying you do you do need to sort of switch off and go mm -hmm. I, I need some normality but then yeah. Naomi those scenes were intense terrifying mm -hmm. how do you go from oh and your weekend you did this this and this and go how did you oh, balance the two it's a good question. I think I was asking myself that throughout <laughs> and learning, <laughs> learning as I went, actually. But um, as Michelle said, I think levity is really important. It helped that it helped that we were doing the scenes almost like a play. They were like, you know, 15 minute long scenes and doing wow. them as a whole, I think, really helped with the natural progression of the scene, because obviously sometimes when things are chopped up, for editing purposes, you might be after lunch on one shot and, you know, before mm. lunch and it can feel a little bit disjointed, but it was, it was nice to kind of like, um, to do it all in one. And then for me, it's funny, actually, something just came to mind. I remember my chair was like, um, in, so for example, just to give you an example of me learning, I was like, oh, I, you know, I kind of need my space to conserve my energy and to mm. kind of like, and, and I almost isolated myself at first and was like, oh, I'm going to put my chair like near, you know, where I'm going to walk in because I was almost like worried. I didn't want to break anything that I was in. And then I very quickly realized, oh no, I'm not going to be, this is not actually going to give me the energy. I need to be around people. Mm. And, um, and so I was like, came back over and like changed with my chair. And I was, I was like, let's watch some YouTube videos. You know, I need, we need some fun stuff to look yeah. at. Um, and so, our visors and yeah. plastic, you know, that was very intense time. Oh yeah, we had know, like plastic, plastic inside. And... Like we had these sort of pods, you know, so we'd be sort of talking through these plastic <laughs> things. I've got a very funny picture of you actually. With the thing. <laughs> um, so yeah, so I think I was learning as I went and then obviously in the courtroom itself is so impressive in terms of the, the set um, and walking out, it, it's really nerve wracking. So it's almost like the environment really kind of puts you in that space. Yeah. So, and I always say this, if me, if me as an actor who's just, you know, playing a role and none of, none of it is, is real, if I'm feeling that nervous, I can't imagine how someone must feel having to walk out and, um, retell their trauma to people who aren't necessarily supportive but are, are actually deciphering whether you're even telling the truth or not or, or kind of you know judging you in that way mm -hmm. um so i think definitely that was an eye-opener for me but no we we definitely had some laughs in between i always say her in the wig you know got a <laughs> michelle in a wig it's yeah, I mean, there's <laughs> nothing fun with that, you know. Well, Michelle and Naomi, I could talk to you so much more about this, but we're going to have to let the audience do the talking because there's so many talking points coming out of this TV series. I just want to say a massive thank you and thank you for taking the thank time. You. Thank you.